Hello there, this is Smith Welding and Restoration. I am your host, Adam Niffin. Stick around, see what's in the garage this week. Yeah, Alright, no, it's not Sunday, but yeah, we're starting the morning off here. Um, huh. Yeah, so I'm getting ready to head out. Check out where we're at on the Monte Carlo, where I left off last night, basically. And a bunch of little stuff going on. I got a car lot job. I'm not going to show you that. Um, we signed a Mercedes, 1967 Mercedes job. Beautiful car. Will be a beautiful car. Cool owner. This is kind of like the the Tuesday morning, I guess, updates or whatever the fuck, right? Um, my videos are intended for the purpose of, you know, some entertainment, some information, some knowledge uh, shared. And a lot of my quote knowledge is shared are simply I fucked this up three times doing this. This is what I found that works better for me. Um, I'm not going to pass off what I do, what I know, how I do things as the authoritative method. Because there's more ways of, of doing a project or a particular situation correctly. You know, in short, there's a ton of correct methodologies out there. <laughs> um, I know that I do not adhere to a lot of people's ideals, okay? And to be frank, I learned a lot from you guys. Uh, I watch the videos when I'm able. I've been busy lately, so my video watching has been reduced to uh, a very, very small, minor aspect of, of the videos I used to watch. And, and I'll jump in and get caught back up. I, I try to focus on, on one author, one channel, when I've got a, a moment and get caught up, you know, I'll get caught up in the immediate news feed and then go back and dig, see the other stuff I've missed. But like, Sunday morning coffees, these little things here. <laughs> Primarily aimed at you guys in the YouTube Garage Gang. Um, Darren's exactly right. You, everybody, all of you out there, leave me with a certain amount of accountability for what I'm doing and how quickly or how slowly it's getting done. <laughs> Well, mind you, go back and look through the videos. That Monte Carlo, I started first of the year. And by started, I mean pulled into the yard and let hang out because I didn't get to start on it. February, I shut the shop down. I didn't work. Uh, it was just, it was too expensive. Um, basically, if I could have paid myself what it cost to run the shop in January, I would have been far better off. I didn't really have any help in there January. But it was kind of an interlude, beginning of the week. Um, I've got what could be the starts of some drama through my comments feed. Just stop it. Um, I had a good friend basically come to my defense with 
an attention getting little boy. It's just not necessary, folks. You don't like what I do? Jog on. The fucking doors that way. You don't agree with what I say? Correct me. But, you know, I'm not going to be belittling to you. <laughs> I'm not going to strike out, lash out at you. It's just not necessary. And that was really my biggest vice for hitting the record button, sitting here this morning, having my coffee before work. I've got my vices, okay? I do smoke too much. I know that. When I'm really stressed, it can get as bad as two packs a day. Um, it just is. You know what? Let me get this little endeavor off the ground where I can breathe easy about just basics. There you go. That's a cat getting in trouble. You know, when I can breathe easy and just the basics, then, then we'll talk about quitting smoking. I don't drink. Not anything to write home to Ma about. Every now and again, I'll have a sip. But I don't drink for, for the drunk. Uh... I've never done drugs. No interest in it. Uh, it does, there's... Not my bag. I buy tools, I work on cars. A decade ago, it was I buy tools and work on houses. <laughs> my aim for my videos is simple. Two years ago, I wasn't doing body and paint professionally. I am now. And I've had a hell of a good run at it. And I'm going to keep going. All I do is get better and stronger every day, every week. Now, the learning curve was dramatically blown by you guys in YouTube land. And i got to hand my appreciations out there. Jeff, VW Darren, Pete. Uh, gosh, I know the list goes on. I'm missing people there, and I'm sorry. Rick. Whew. You want to see some really intricate metal fabrication? The Rick Fix. That guy brought that poor Nova back from from the dead. It was a parts car when he started, basically. I, you know, I tip my hat to that man because the patience and perseverance. I don't think I would have thrown into that car, but he did, and it's amazing. I try to impart a little bit of my life that's, in relative terms, drama-free. Little things we get into, little stuff we see, find, otherwise. And to give back to that pool of knowledge that's out there. Um, I get thumbs down, whatever, you know, that's cool. You don't like it. Um... You know, I, I wanna I wanna share what I'm doing as a shameless self promotion. So the other parts when I'm showing the cars I'm working on and videos on you know on less do but show, yeah it's it's self promoting. I got a small shop. It's how I feed my family. Uh, am I the best artisan out there? No. Uh Will I be the best one day? I'll be in the top list. This is just the beginning, folks. Stick around. Watch us grow. Um, I think you'll see some cool stuff on the horizon. It's going to take a couple years to get to point of establishment that I would deem comfortable. 
I'll keep sharing videos with the YouTube Garage Gang. I'll keep sharing my little knowledges with all of you and the hows and whys and don't do this aspects. <laughs> I'll keep teaching and I'll keep learning. Everybody out there has something to teach. Go out there, hit the record button, and teach it. Um, I'm not a judgmental prick. And I got no time for it. In my existence, I don't want the drama, I don't want the headaches. I like my mellow little life. I'm a hermit on an acre of land where I live and work. These folks have a great day. We'll catch up with you in the shop.